So hello guys, welcome back to the new tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to see what are all or plus filtered, all except and all no blank rows functions in Power BI DAX. So as the name suggests, the all function returns all the rows in a table or all the values in a column, ignoring any filters that might have been applied. Then the second one, which is or close filtered clears all the filters which are applied to a table. This is similar to the remove filter function that we have in Power BI Dash. Then the third one which is all except. It removes all the context filter in a table except filters that have been applied to a specified columns. And lastly we have the all no blank row function. It from the parent table of a relationship it returns all the rows but the blank row or all the distinct value of a column but the blank row and disregards any context filters that might exist. Now let's try to understand their syntax first. So for that what I will do is I will just create a new major. So for that go to home and inside my calculation tab there is one option known as new major. So just click on this. And first I will start with all filter. So I will just type all function over here. So as you guys can see it is asking me for table name and column name and it will return all the rows of a table or all the values in a column. So this is how this all filter all function works. Then we have the all cross filtered. Over here you just have to pass your table name and it will clear all the filters which are applied to this table name. Again this is similar to the remove filter function that we have. Then the third one which is all except. Again this is similar. It removes all the context filter in the table except the filters that are previously applied to the specified column. And over here you just have to give the table name and column name which is similar to the all field all function. And so on you have the all no blank row as well. So in this way we can apply all all cross filtered all except and all no blank row in a power bi dax thank you so much for watching this tutorial stay tuned for more upcoming tutorials